Monday, the gym. Tuesday, the grocery store. Wednesday, the art museum. Thursday, coffee shop. Friday, music festival early. Friday, late night, nightclub. Uh, Saturday, a friend's party. And Sunday, church. I, in my mind, I imagine a really religious girl would fall like ultra Bible orthodoxy and is like, a woman should honor her husband no matter what. I need that kind of woman because I'm an idiot. And so she'd have to respect me, even though on a daily basis I would make her life miserable. Exactly. Honey, I drove the car into a pole. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay, dear. I mean, like, oh, I love you and Jesus. Don't mistake someone who's outgoing and approachable for single and available. And if this happens to you, don't be rude. It makes for a bad dating karma. Greetings, ladies! <laughs> you need to, at a bar, you just need to wait. And you go up to the woman and you're just like, hey, why don't we talk over a drink? And she'll be like, sure. And be like, well, when are you going to buy it? Watch, 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 sit on my, sit on my dick. <laughs> <laughs> that's, the, that's my pickup line. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. First off, guy who's like, oh, these two women. If two women approach you together, you're not about to score threesome. Those are two women, two friends, who are about to use you for your drinks and food and then never talk to you again. It's like, hey, here's a stupid guy. Oh my god, let's go flirt with him, Danielle. Okay. And they go over to you and you're like, hey, ladies, I have champagne and wine and shit and a bunch of cheese. Why don't you you sit next to me and then we can do it later? And they're like, sure. (laughs) And then they eat your shit and you never see them again. This one guy broke a million hearts that week. He did. What a dickhole. This is the man, this is a man who has not seen a vagina in a long time. This guy needs to be single forever. 